Annunciation Catholic College, Uroa, the first secondary school in Asenland, was established in 1955 when the Benin province was part of the defunct western region of Nigeria that had its capital at Ibadan. The history of Annunciation Catholic College, Uroa, therefore, is the history of the development of post-primary education in Asenland. Its establishment opened the way for the establishments of Asa Grammar School, Uromi, Anglican Grammar School, Epoma, and Pilgrim Baptist Grammar School, Ewoemi, within the decade 1955 to 1965. Annunciation Catholic College, Uroa, is therefore the father of all the secondary schools in Asenland. Most of the early products of the school were employed as the teachers in the other schools that were later established in the region. In the colonial era, secondary schools owned by the British administration were few. Therefore, the missions participated actively in the establishment and administration of more schools to meet the expanding educational desires of parents and their children. In 1954, Bishop Patrick Kelly, who was Bishop of Benin Ecclesiastical Diocese, got approval to establish a secondary school in Asaland. He naturally chose a Reverend Father Ansem Ojefwa for the new project. Father Ojefwa had obtained graduate degrees in sociology, history and mathematics at Cork University in Ireland. He had also gained valuable and extensive experience in school administration at St. Patrick's College, Asaba. Father Ojefwa moved to Iroi in 1955 to face the new challenge. There were no structures on ground and the assignment was urgent. On arrival at Iroa, Father Ojefwa consulted widely with prominent Iroa leaders, including the Onoje. Dr. Christopher Okoje, Chief Odiase, Prince Shaka Momodu, and others. At the end of his consultations, a large parcel of virgin land was secured for the school. However, prior to working at the site, Father Ojefwa negotiated for and secured a temporary place at the private residence of Prince Shaka Momodu opposite Zuma Memorial Hospital, Iroa, where he started the school. The 30 pioneer students, Mr. Obaita, who was the school's first tutor, and Father Ojefwa founder, principal, lived in this temporary site. During the first year, the nearby primary school, St. Paul Primary School, Aho, Iroa, served as venue for Mars and its field was used for sporting activities, while the diocesan building contractor Reverend Father Fagan intensified construction work at the school's permanent site. A principal's house, a chapel, classroom blocks and a hostel block were built in record time. In January 1956, the school moved to the permanent site and through extraordinary commitment and hard work, the first set of students spent just five years to complete their secondary school education. It was an unprecedented achievement by the school, its students, teachers and administrators because most newly founded schools in that era spent an additional year to prepare their students for graduation. Father Ojefwa ensured that everything was perfected for the educational inspectors who frequently visited the school to assess its readiness for the Cambridge School Certificate Examination. The school standards were so high that the first set, which started out with 30 students, ended with 13 students. The successful founding of ACC and the graduation of its first set of students in 1959 made the fame of the school and its founder, Father Ojefwa, to spread like wildfire. The school became a top choice for parents and their children. 
The student's population was diverse. Parents sent their children from far lands, including Europe and America, to be educated at ACC Iroa. Several decades after its founding, ACC remained one of the most celebrated secondary schools in Nigeria and West Africa. The school is universally reputed for its illustrious alumni who are making their mark in the global community with their immense contributions to the public good as physicians, dentists, pharmacists, lawyers, judges, engineers, accountants, architects, professors, scientists, legislators, public servants, business executives, and entrepreneurs. Over the years, interesting as the story of ACC was, the school has consistently experienced the worst neglect and infrastructural decay as a result of its takeover by the Nigerian government in 1975. Today, ACC is a sad shadow of its former self. The school is in a complete state of degeneration. ACC needs your help. Please support the $1.5 million ACC Reconstruction Fund with your generous donation. The Annunciation Catholic College Iroa Old Boys Association in North America is determined to rebuild ACC for the future generation of its students and ensure the school's return to the Catholic mission. The ACC Reconstruction Project is a five-section plan. Section 1. Section 1 will feature projects accessible from the first gate leading to the principal's house. It will include 1. A new gate and a paved road for pedestrian and vehicular traffic. 2. A 20-bed ACC medical center to serve the school and neighboring villages. 3 humanitarian and social services center four center for leadership and entrepreneurship five alumni center six rooms kitchen dining and a mini gym section two section two consists of one a new main gate two a sports complex to the left with football and athletic tracks to be co-located and built as a mini stadium. Section 3. Section 3 focuses on salvaging existing buildings in the middle of the school, rebuilding of the damaged library and the renovation of the school chapel. Section 4. Section 4 is the Agua Lake Gate end of the school. It will feature 1. A new gate. 2. A 600-seater multi-purpose lecture theatre. 3. A multi-apartment staff quarters. And 4. A fully equipped engineering and maintenance building. Section 5. The back of the school makes up Section 5, which will have 1. A hostel complex with study rooms, kitchen and cafeteria. 2. A recreation centre. 3 one or two boreholes and water treatment plant and four a power generator solar power plant or solar power built-in to all residential buildings we count on your kind support please donate generously are we still proud of and college in the states it is now should we desire to send our children Will ACC still be one of our choices? The answer is surely is no. Why? 
it is because the glory of ACC as we knew it in the last few decades has distressingly rolled down the slope, has dipped to a very uncomfortable level. Should we open our eyes despite the blessings God has bestowed on us so wonderfully? Allow ACC to remain in this state. I'm sure the answer still is no. What should we do? Let us, as individuals, as families, as branches, and in collectivity, to bring light to ACC. Let us improve the infrastructural landscape of ACC. Let us bring about the development of ACC. It is only in this way that at the end of our life's pilgrimage, when we look back, we will say, yes, we were a part of the old boys that brought light to ACC. And that is why I, as the immediate past global president of our great Akiba, implore all of us to look back using our time, our treasures, our skill and knowledge, and all the wonderful things God has given unto us to charitably dip our hands into our pockets to help develop our great alma mater. The goal for the association is that we should take ACC to a higher plane in terms of education and moral standards. We should not depend on the government alone. The old students should also contribute. That's what we are doing. Our library is no longer functioning well. At we least we, we have been contributing we, are, we have been contributing money at least to ensure that we build a befitting library for the school. The main focus of the discussions today is um, how best to help our alma mater and association Catholic College in Roa to regain its former glory in terms of structures, in terms of uh, the academic performance of the students. It's for us to get together, pull heads together, you know, um, raise funds to ensure that uh, our alma mater stays alive. ACC Youth Boys, or Association Catholic College, Irwa, is a school that has distinguished herself in the academic world. As a matter of fact, what we are doing now, we are trying to bring the school back to missionary. ACC Irwa will become a very new college that we will be proud of. We are very pleased and we hope that as soon as possible this project will commence and the state government will also be available not only to commission but to hand it over to the mission which has been our prime goal even since the beginning of uh, the establishment and the running of this association. They may start wondering how can you help? How can I be involved? That is the bit that I want to share with you. Number one, you can adopt a unit as yours, build it, and have a naming right to it. Number two, you can team up with one or several of your friends to adopt a unit of the project, build it, and also exercise a right to name it. Thirdly, you can coordinate with your school set, ACC school set, to adopt a unit or more, build it or build them, and name it or name them after your like. Number four, Choose a unit of the project as an Acuba branch and build it and name it after your branch. Number five, convince your friends, your associates and other colleagues in private sector to adopt a unit of the project as their community development project 
name it after their name. Number six, you can use your influence to convince eminent persons or corporate organizations around the world to adopt a unit or more of the project in support of education in Africa. Number eight, and not the least, we have a common port. You can donate to it. Nothing is too small, nothing is too great. Be part of this. ACC, no rival. The past three decades, old boys of ACC Iroa repeatedly rehabilitated the original buildings built in the 1950s. As we approach year 2021 and beyond, our focus is different. We are committed to rebuilding the school and equipping it to meet educational needs in the 21st century. We can do it with the help of all old boys, our families, friends, and supporters worldwide. We can do it. We count on you. We count on everybody's support. We count on you. Thank you. We are in this together. 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 Let's join hands. Let's, Let's join, join hands. hands. Let us join hands. And rebuild. And rebuild. And rebuild. And rebuild. And rebuild ACC. And rebuild ACC. Folks, we can do it. Yes, we can do it. We can do it. I say it again. We can do it. ACC, no rival. ACC, no rival. ACC, no rival.